I'm Carla Wade. Right now on your 13 Action News update, the search is on for a hit and run driver who left a woman critically injured and her dog dead. And this surveillance video happened to catch the crash. We're not going to show you all of it because it's graphic and difficult to watch. It happened yesterday in North Las Vegas near Lexington and Cary Avenue. Police say that they found that vehicle late last night, but there's still no word on who may have been driving. And a 23 year old woman has died more than a week after a crash involving a semi truck. It happened near Torrey Pines and Blue Diamond. Troopers say the driver of that car was speeding and the woman who died was a passenger. The driver still fighting for his life. With valley temperatures expected to be over 100 degrees, emergency room visits are on the rise. ERs tend to see a spike in visits during the summer, from sunburns to the more serious heat strokes. In 2017, the National Weather Service reported 107 heat-related deaths across the U.S. Well, enjoy tonight before that real heat moves in. Temperatures staying just below 100 today. We're going to see mostly uh, cloudy skies with those thin layer of high clouds out there overall. Not much of an issue tonight. Temperatures will drop back into the upper to mid 70s across the Las Vegas Valley. Tomorrow the heat's on excessive heat warning kicks in and that lasts through Wednesday as temperatures are going to be the hottest so far this year and the hottest since last summer. I have more on that coming up tonight on 13 Action News. All right. Thank you, Dan. That was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNB.com. Thank you for making 13 Action News part of your day.